If you're watching this yarn, you're probably familiar with the basic conventions of contemporary storytelling. So you probably heard of the hero, probably heard of the anti-hero too. But I bet my mother's false teeth you ain't never heard of a non-hero. Meet Tony Hoops and Ruan Don Valentes, ramblers, gamblers, and losers by trade. So I spend two full weeks on a sandy white beach in Bayside and on top of a sandy white broad named Becky. But I tell you what, I got a little restless. Well, what's there to get restless about? No action. So I think to myself, I says, I wonder what my old friend Ron is doing back in the City of the Angels. Ah, jeez, Tom. I ain't been doing nothing. Exactly. So, I got us a score. Oh, I don't know about that, Tom. Oh, oh hey, look, hey, have you heard of Beauregard Figgis? Beauregard Figgis? Yeah. That Beauregard Figgis, in case you've been living with your head in your ass, Figgis was the West Side's biggest hustler. He had a dirty finger in every dirty pie and in lots of other dirty places, too. Tell me the whole story again, baby, one more time. So I find myself seeing Figgis' girl, Tammy. Turns out this girl is certifiably insane and very flexible. And she explains to me her and Figgis are experiencing a little trouble in paradise, courtesy of his new squeeze, a hard-bodied party animal named Candy. Tammy's over the whole thing and wants to move on, but not before getting what she's owed. My Figgy, well, I call him Figgy on the account I give all my men pet names. I hear he's expecting a big cash shipment on Christmas Day from some Mexican guys. Yeah? Yeah. Cute. And on the account of it's the holidays, he's a little short on height and muscle. Yeah? Yeah. So uh, wouldn't it be a travesty if all that cash was wasted on some low life creep like Figgy? Yeah. Where is this whole thing going, Tony? The story's been taken forever. Yeah, okay. So me and Tammy, we make sweet bedroom flapjacks, right? And she just comes out with it. She proposes a 50-50 split. She tells us the location. And all we gotta do is break in and take the cash. Oh, I don't know, man. That's, that sounds awful screwy. That could be a real gamble. A gamble, Ron. It is an empty warehouse full of cash. Look, Ron, my old buddy, my pal, my partner in this glorious hustle they call life. Don't you want to buy your kids something nice for Christmas? <laughs> what do you say, amigo? I'm in. Neither Tony nor Ron was too bright to begin with, but add a broad into the mix, eh, and they were practically buffoons. Okay, so the plan is real simple. Tammy has provided us with the address, so all we gotta do is walk in, grab the cash, and then meet her at the rendezvous point. Wh wh what the heck is all this? Disguises. You're gonna wanna be incognito in case you get spotted. And that? Oh, this is just in case, you know, the heat gets hot. And I can only get one, though, so... A freaking dart gun? I don't like this. Hey, hey, it's just a precaution, okay? And you can tape it up, make it look real legit. You're gonna look so strong and tough standing there. There's nothing to worry about. Oh, this place smells like my granny's underwear drawer. Oh. Why do I gotta be the elf, huh? How do you think I feel? I'm half Jewish. This place is huge. Where are we going? I don't know. Did you read the directions? Ronnie, that cash could be right around the corner. <laughs> Tony, you screwed me. Come on, let's talk about it. Let's talk. 
Who the hell are you guys? How did you get in here? You got a lot of balls busting up this game. I don't know if you know this. This is our annual Christmas game. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> How the hell did they get a, get an elf in here? It was Tammy. It was Tammy. Tammy, he's screwing her behind your back, man. She sent us. She sent us to get your money. Run! What? I'm not gonna die for her. I'm not. I thought you said she could be trusted. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you're lying to me! Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 stop! You stop! You stop! You stop! You stop! I'm gonna go! I'll kill them all! I'm gonna kill everybody! I'm gonna kill Yes, it's Christmas, damn it! This is our game! What's the matter with you guys? You know what? Screw this. I'm leaving. Tammy had been playing them all from the start. She'd grown tired of bunking with an over-the-hill gangster and babysitting a loser like Tony, so she'd found a way to cancel them both out. Tammy thought she'd planned the whole fiesta to a T, but she forgot the one rule of the game. You know, I was right. Crime does pay. You play long enough, you always get hustled in the end. You don't gotta like the morality of the whole thing. What the hell, you don't even gotta like the damn story. But you can't knock it, baby. It's just a hustle. And for some, that's all there is. Yeah.